Looking for the perfect tool to build your documentation site? Today we're comparing three popular options, Docusaurus, Gitbook, and MKDocs. Let's break down each one and see which one is best for your needs. Docusaurus, built by Facebook, is an open source static site generator designed for software documentation. It's React-based, offering rich customization through themes and plugins. With built-in search, versioning, and support for Markdown and MDX, it's ideal for complex large-scale projects. It's free, self-hosted, and integrates with platforms like GitHub Pages or Versal. However, it may require React knowledge for advanced tweaks. Gitbook is a cloud-based platform for collaborative documentation. It's user-friendly with a clean interface, built-in analytics, and SSO support. It's great for teams needing real-time collaboration and version control. Gitbook supports Markdown and integrates with tools like Slack and GitHub. It's free for open source projects, but has paid tiers for commercial use, which can get pricey for larger teams. MKDocs is a lightweight open source static site generator focused on simplicity. It's Python-based, easy to set up, and uses Markdown for content. With themes like Material for MKDocs, it's visually appealing and SEO-friendly. It's best for smaller projects, but lacks built-in multi-user editing and advanced search without plugins. It's free and self-hosted with a supportive community. So, which is best? DocuSaurus shines for large, complex documentation with its robust plugin ecosystem and flexibility, but it does have a steeper learning curve. Gitbooks excels in team collaboration and ease of use, ideal for non-technical users, but it is costly for commercial projects. MKDocs is perfect for simple, budget-friendly projects with minimal setup, but it is less feature-rich. Check out our comparison chart for a quick overview. Choose DocuSaurus for power, Gitbook for collaboration, or MKDocs for simplicity. Let us know your favorite in the comments, Subscribe for more tech comparisons and I'll see you in the next video.